I have the greatest employer in the world. I don't work for a man or a woman. I work for God. And in the end, you do too. The real genius ability that will come through you will not be of your own. It will be God coming through you. It will be God thinking through you, giving you ideas, speaking for you through your own mouth, using your mind, your abilities, your talent, your energy. It will be something magnificent, especially for you to witness <laughs> when it occurs because it changes everything. God deserves your best and I pray today that you'll ask yourself the question, is God getting my best? I pray that God is. Do you make an appointment with God each day and keep it? It's one of the uh, systems of our gratitude to God calendar system, is we make an appointment with God daily, and we keep it, because God always keeps the appointments. God is always there, but we give our attention to God, and we await God's guidance and God's direction, and then we give it our best. When we acquire the habit of focusing our hearts and our minds on God, searching out for God's will in our lives, God will guide our steps and bless our every endeavor. But if we allow distractions to sidetrack us and take priority over our relationship with God, well, they will. And we will suffer in the end for our misplaced priorities. We won't be at our best. It is important to set goals because if you have a plan, a goal, a direction, a purpose, and a focus, you are not going to you're not going to do it alone. You are going to go with God and you will take those goals and your purpose and you'll say, God, I had this idea and I believe you have given me this idea and I, I now take it to you. Show me the way. And often, it will be in a completely different direction than you have ever comprehended in human mind. But you will be wise, my friend, if you'll follow that, that new path, <laughs> the path less traveled, and uh, you'll find great success in doing so. It says in Luke 6.44, it says, Each tree is known by its own fruit. This is not talking about trees. It's talking about you. It's talking about me. We each have our own fruit to give to life, our own harvest to give to life. And when the life of God comes through us, that harvest will be magnificent. And when we give the attention to God on a daily basis, it will be at its best. God bless you.